Hi guys, I'm back with another video of EU4 Hindustan playthrough. So we're doing a quick little war to claim some land that rebelled from Delhi. Just another chunk out of Delhi. We got a lot of land. Units suffered casualties. Oh well, yeah, don't stand in such a big stack on top of each other. It would help. Tripoli. What on earth is AI doing? Seriously, first Ottomans in Tripoli. We're on a different side of the damn continent. And they have a, a guts to ask for access. It doesn't even help them in any way. And oh. You guys. Deal with them first. I need to fix my legitimacy. I can't annex anyone until I fix it. So I'll just have v vassals for a while. Just lots of them, lots and lots of vassals. And when is that exactly expiring? That stupid annoying thing? Yeah, this. October, so near the end of the next year. Yeah, exactly a year to go. I can cope. Wow, I'm getting attrition? Oh yeah, another change. Yes, another change. When you're sieging, by default you get 1% attrition just for sieging. So, that sucks. It's like a raw siege attrition because before it didn't make sense like you always when you siege you get attrition say for example you'd get uh, some archers from the fort you're sieging you pick off you of your guys who are standing and making sure that no one's bringing in supplies into the city uh, it's, it's still out of reach yeah it is and i don't see any other land The non-exploration colonial game is uh, unusual, let's just say. Oh, can't I beat them up and take their stuff? That would be nice. What's finished here? Um, I finish making... Wow, they're pissed. Yeah, let's do more fabrication so we can get more land next time. How is it going with coring anyway? Only 20% of extension, that's not too bad. I think I need to lower this. 75. Can I lower it a different way? Oh yeah. Send! Someone who can do a job quickly! Where did I get that province? I'm not sure. I think not. I don't need to really reduce. I got lots of money. I should look into... How can I improve my income? Manpower. Uh, I wonder, that might be a good pick, because I don't imagine myself expanding into that direction anytime soon, but I'm unsure. Farm estate, that sounds more useful. Or weapons, let's do weapons first. And that cost me all my savings. So, whoops. I didn't think it through. Alright, so all of these new guys are... Very aggressive. Where's my priest guy? Uh, no. Yeah, he is here, isn't he? Ah, uh, don't ask, I don't bother you, so don't ask for stupid permissions. 
What's the tax base here? One. So not very useful. Um, military technology, I can still wait. Production efficiency. That sounds tempting. So I'm gonna leave this missionary strength guy. Diplomatic relations, I have no choice but to leave. And come on, um, I'm taking huge attrition here. I can survive with it, I think. 28%. Yeah, I'm getting a big modifier here. I should split this army. They must be taking massive attrition. 26 stack of toll. And hooray for whatever I did. I don't remember what I picked. Uh, make my f navy bigger. Oh yeah, improved relations, that's what I did. Timurids liking me. Nah, too much effort. Take Ogto or something along those lines. Ogto. I don't feel like it. I think I might be a truce with them. I'm not. I still don't feel like expanding so rapidly. I think I'm gonna do proper fleet. So I need to reach 75% and... Oh dear. That might be a lot more work than I thought. Do you have any good shipyards? Okay, you'll do. So, for starters, I'm gonna get a uh, couple of cogs. I lost one cog, and I think, uh, yeah, let's take three cogs. Is there another place with a uh, shipyard? Yeah, this is it. And let's get, say, five box for now. And I'll add later on maybe more. I wish I didn't have a claim on me. Still coring. Not too bad. And I'm getting tariffs from here, so that's all fine. annexation or just take that and vassalize what's full and okay how much money can I swindle out of you nothing who do I make angry um I'll make angry one of the guys that I want to make angry What's suggested demands? I don't like these suggested demands. Clear offer, full annexation. Let's go with that. And let's split this army again. Before it causes more damage. Still the same annoying option. 30. Yeah, we can afford 30. And uh, 20. Yeah, we can afford 20. And let's give him boot. This one is fine. Religion Hindu. That's cool. Sunni is the problem. What religion base are you guys? Delhi, yes, Sunni. 
annoying pests. But we have to put up with them. If we're planning to make any progress. Now rebellions are pretty bad. I'm just thinking, would it be worth investing into another stability? I've got the overextension, so maybe first fix that. Let's check my overextension. Oh, it's for quite a while. Now you guys... How did I fix you? You're annoyed about aggressive expansion, so now... Uh, do you have enemy of enemy? Yes, I do. Oh, that doesn't give you so much points anymore. I thought it, I thought it used to give you plus 50 or something. Oh, I guess I need to wait you out. Because I took so many negative points. Diplomatic relations. That does not help. So now I can have uh, nine vassals. All deep contacts with nine p factions. I just need more legitimacy. And it's like really improving relations ain't gonna help me here. Because you're not my vassal yet. So I'm running low on op uh, like uh, options. Can I afford this guy? 22 a month. No, I can't. I'll just take someone cheap for now. Missionary strength. How is your missionary going? He's okay. Others. They need to introduce some fix to missionary strength problems. I wonder if there's anything in here. Uh, that just adds an extra missionary. Controlling Rome. That's a bit far for India. Uh, nothing there helps me. That is not even doable. Uh, okay. So I can't do this. All I can do is conquest of Rome. I can't do this because I'm not Muslim or Christian. And do we have a big enough stack to deal with them? Yes, we do. Go deal with them. That has my king in there. Where are you back from? Fabricating claim. Can I fabricate another claim? Yes, thank you. Ah, oh, but how long this aggressive expansion? I want to go into another war. Because my truce is almost expired with Swahili. Or well, not almost, actually two years away. Oh, I thought it was almost. I need to make you like me. And it's not going well. Who's that? Delhi. And what's... Stability inflation... Ah, uh, free inflation and lost one stability. I think I can fix my stability quite cheap. And now inflation re reflects into, in a sense, into cost of administrative power anyway. So it is a bad thing. Wow, these rebellion risks. I can sort of manage them. But it's not very good management. As you can see, <laughs> I have to run around like a headless guy chasing everyone. Oh, military access has been given to what? Oh, I'm not sure what happened. Are we discovering anything? That's my question. It doesn't look like it. 
Is the option just seeing discoveries? Oh, not really. Ah, this is a slow time of year where nothing happens. We build fleet, what's all? Fleet uh, size. Still got quite a bit to go. And beat that army up. I fear to look at my re rebellion map mode. It's just gonna be scary if I do, isn't it? Yeah. I got it right, it looks scary. Okay, where's big tax bases? Something like nines or eights. I'll, I'll go with eight. Come on, find me a good tax base. There's a nine. Wow, this will cost me actually a lot more than I thought. Uh, you go deal with that. Because the money inc uh, where's the nine? Yeah, the money increase would be quite good. Uh, should we go for the money? Revolt risk is actually reducing my income. I want my stability back, but I got this overextension to deal with. Uh, okay. Another rebel suppress. Now you guys... How long will it take for you to actually like me? So I can get improve it by 10. Well, 9. But for improved relations, that's not enough. Too many negatives. Uh, at least borders friction is normal. I don't know why I clicked that. Just felt like it. I'm not gonna deal with another diplomatic thing. So many auto saves. Haven't played Iron Man for a while, so I forgot how bad it is. Now, there's one reason I'm not gonna do this. Now, global trade power is all cool and it'll give me money, but as I got positive income anyway, it's not a big deal. The reason I'm not gonna do this is because it'll give me this. Permanent castles belly against Asia. And that basically means permanent uh, minus 15 uh, diplomatic relations with everyone in Asia. Which is a bad thing. So that's the reason I'm not gonna do it. Are you still fussy about the vassalization? Yes, you are. Can't someone fall apart here? And like, give me land. That would be cool if they did. Uh, nothing to do. Why? What did I do to them? Guys, I've been staying away from you. Ah, aggressive expansion. Still, I've been staying away from you. Do you have like a bunch of castles belly against you? No, apparently just two. Who else is in this coalition? You and Swahili. Huh. I guess I'll have a two-side war once uh, I go for my Swahilian lands claims. We need to add some ways of reducing these negatives. I didn't make them like me. Like, there should be some other option. Or for military access. Uh, that gave me plus... Uh, 
What did it give me? Plus 10. Okay, let's pause and see. This rebels are... Okay, so we can deal with rebels. And... Uh, these guys want an alliance, but they're too big. And for that I'm declining it. I'm not interested in big guys. And that's a diplomat back. Oh, I've, I've, I've finished my other claim here. And completely forgot to figure out that I meant to do another one. They must hate me. No, they don't. Why are you still in the coalition then? Well, they do hate me. They outraged. Aggressive conquest of them. That's what I'm doing. Little surprise that they're outraged. Ah, oh, I don't have legitimacy. It's my heir. He's average. Average is better than this weak guy. Can't he die? Wait, this guy's still too young. Stay alive a bit longer. How long do you have to stay alive for? Actually, you'll stay alive for like another 20 years or so. So can't get rid of you that easily. But if I just lowered it enough, I'd get a lot of things fixed. Ah, uh, so many things. Well, why is my rec oh yeah, I just had a fight. It's gonna say like, why am I paying extra for my army? Do you have any Casas Bell against you? Just one. That's a bit boring. Uh, I'm not being very enthusiastic because I can't do anything. This is a waiting point in the game. And clicking off all these messages. My advisor is dead. Thank you. At least one messenger informed me of something useful. Oh, it was my guy who was helping me out as well. Should I do yearly inflation reduction? That'll put me in a negative, though. Prestige would be nice. Uh, let's have a look. Inflation, not too bad. I can lower military main... Still wouldn't lower it enough to justify a plus three guy. So I'm gonna get revolt risk reduction and that should help me out more. Now prestige loss or national, I can take national revolt risk. It's annoying but I'll take it. And I think I can build two more transports just because I feel like I want them. Oh, where was it? I'm lost, lost, lost. I'm not sure what I'm clicking. Uh, there you go. Two more and then maybe a couple of box. I'm not unlocking anything soon, am I? Oh yeah, that was my mission actually, to get more ships. So yeah, I just ordered more. And spend more of my money. And my income is pretty bad. Especially since that dropped for a known reason. Why did that drop? I can't tell. I'm collecting here, yeah, I'm collecting. It shouldn't have dropped then. Oh yeah, let's go back. Did I not do this? Apparently I didn't. Oh yeah, decided... I'll wait. The improvement would be so good. I think I'll actually do it. Yeah, I'll do it. Let's call it a big investment. 
it'll pay off in a hundred years. Assuming we'll play that long, well we should. Anyone else? A high income. Oh, that's conversion closer to being done. Why is it so expensive? Why can't it be like overseas? And more manpower. Right, something we did not need. Uh, and here, what did we lose? Oh yeah, we lost the... My, um, a bribe, so send gift. So if we send gift, that adds 25, it's... I just got too much... I don't really have that much negative. Why is it adding up to being such a huge negative then? Let's try doing some maths. I just said I got to cast a spell against them. That's the worst part. Okay, so send them a gift. And that puts us at a slightly better position, but we need to get back to that really high score. Just because I got greedy and conquered someone a bit too early. My idea was uh, hit them early, so before we make any alliances. But at my end, I couldn't make a vassal. Which is slightly stupid on my part. And let's improve relations with them. So send improve relations. Let's see what was has there been any other actions here made available? Dissolve alliance, form coalition. No, I don't think they have I think there was some sort of change in the patch. I'm just unsure what. And another rebellion. U9 stack and handle it. Until I get this out of this situation, I think this playthrough is going to be a bit boring. Since I can't do much. Just wait, 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 and... Cast is barely finished. Don't neglect it. Yes, last claim. And then I can go to war. That'll be fun. Uh, you guys group together. So a couple of cogs. Ah, my forgotten troops on the island. Must suck being them. Oh, this is a lot of provinces. I thought maybe possible to do something with them, but uh, if they got that much land, no. Their Malmuks are very big. Persia. Why is Persia this color? I thought they were a different color. How did they change the color? So Persians were like orangey. At least before, now they're like more my color. Slightly darker. Muscovy. Uh, colonizing by the looks of things. Wow, Japan. There's a bigger text of Japan <laughs> on the mainland than on Japan itself, which I find amusing. How about you discover this island? It's like if I discover the island, I can send my colonists and uh, do something to keep myself from being bored. Uh, so I'm maxed out. Let's see, how's my military? Do I have anyone who... No, no military research guy. Two trade power guys. I think that's bugging out. You shouldn't get that, really. Production efficiency. 
I don't get anyone who get, helps me helps me with research, which is annoying. Declared war, yeah, yeah, that does not matter. How far am I from my force limits? I should be close now. And I'm getting close here, so... Oh, where's my military? Where's my military? Is it 15 now? Yes it is. I might as well do it now and... I've got nothing better to do. So we get... Uh, cavalry archers. Uh, new cannon and we can build the regimental camp cool and what about this our neighbors only five ahead it would increase my income but I don't think it's just worth it now buildings I think here I had somewhere my army area I'll discover it uh, in a second. Where did I have my army area? That's the one. Okay, so that's where I built most of my army and if I build this, it'll reduce its cost. So let's do it. That's being called, that's being called. Yes, two more calls done. And my missionary is still out doing his stuff. Which is slow. Slow and painful. Uh, so close yet so far. And now we're three years before. Yeah, about three years before. These guys will agree to an alliance. Question is, should I try expanding more or waiting it out? And I think it's time for me to put a break, so see you next time.